Hello, boys and girls. Welcome to the Dow Academy Online Learning. We look forward to seeing you all back in class. But for now, stay home, stay safe. And remember to always wash your hands with soap for at least 20 seconds. Let's begin. Good morning, boys and girls. Our lesson today in English, we are going to learn about the use of a few and a little in a sentence. Okay? I know we are learning from home. I'm kindly asking you to stop whatever you are doing and listen to this lesson. Boys and girls, we are going to use a few and a little in a sentence. When do we use a few and when do we use a little? We use a few for things that we can count and we use a little for things that we cannot count. So what are these things that we can count and we cannot count? There are many things that we can count and there are many things that we cannot count. I'll give you an example of things that we can count. Boys and girls, I've got three spoons with me. We can count these spoons. One, two, three. There are three spoons with me. In a sentence, if I want to construct a sentence using a few, I would say I have a few spoons. I have a few spoons. I'll give you another example of things that we cannot count. You see this bowel? There is sugar in this bowel. There is sugar in this bowel. For me to construct a sentence using sugar, I would say there is sugar, there is a little sugar in a bowel. There is a little sugar in a bowel. Sugar we cannot count. We cannot count sugar, therefore we are going to use a little. We can count the spoons, that's why we used a few spoons, because we can be able to count these spoons. Remember at the beginning of the lessons, I said we use a few for things that we can count and we use a little for things that we cannot count. Children, do you understand the lesson? If you understand, I'll give you a small exercise whereby you are going to fill in the missing blanks by the use of a few or a little. Remember, I explained to say we use a few for things that we can count and we use a little for things that we cannot count. This is the end of the lesson, children. I'll see you tomorrow in the next lesson. Stay blessed.